this is a video on this is a playbook blackberry playbook 64 gig um that was security wiped or like brand new like if you were to take it out of the box and apparently blackberry has possibly turned off the server some but anyway the when you load your load it up and ask you for your Wi-Fi and stuff like that it, it forces an update on on it and this is what you inevitably get after the little demo screen and this is what you cannot get out of you end up with this loop see here this 404 loop and you can hit retry used the old trick apparently was to wait let the Wi-Fi catch and then you hit retry and then you could update it or checking for updates this one I believe is still it is the latest version it doesn't matter the device wants to update there it is see could not activate this ta tablet unknown error and then you click restart and you will get the screen that I showed you before here's the the problem Blackberry of course they don't support support the playbook any further but they should have at least put a a piece of the software that you could skip the update and let you just bypass that part because the device is still useful is it rebooting okay there it is so it reboots took a little while there and you'll see it'll just go right back to that screen again these devices still have useful usefulness they, you can read PDFs I primarily like it because like on a 64 gig unit you can put a bunch of videos on and just play them nothing wrong with that these are cheap people sell these on eBay they wipe them and then they sell them on eBay for 30, 40, 50 bucks, whatever, it depends on the size. And nothing wrong with that. It still has a use now and then. But BlackBerry now, because they've turned off the server, they have effectively bricked these things. And now what, what's your option here? To throw it away. Throw away a perfectly good device that has a use for something. Okay? It still has a function. And this is supposed to be, what, a Canadian company, and it has QNX on it, all these environmental-friendly, all these so-called things, but yet, and here it is, and this is what you're stuck in, this infinite loop of this. And that's just wrong. They need to lift this or turn the server back on so people don't end up throwing thousands of these things away when they could be using them for something obviously if someone buys this for 30 40 bucks on eBay to give it a second or third life there's nothing wrong with that why does Blackberry shut this down so you can't use the device anymore and now it's just gonna end up in the landfill doing anyone nothing okay it's rude and so if anyone out there sees this video and knows someone that works at Blackberry RIM or QNX Tell them this is disgusting and this is wrong. And to turn the damn server back on so this device can sniff out its little update and then move along with the process of activation. Okay, it's got nothing to do with a BlackBerry account. You can create a BlackBerry account all day long. And if you buy one of these used on eBay, it's important that the person selling it not erase the account. Do not do a security wipe or you will get a device that you think is going to set up an account, log on. But the problem is these devices always do this no matter what after the demo loads and you will be left with a useless device. So if you buy one used or you're going to give it away, do not security wipe it because QNX or BlackBerry rather has turned off the server that's forcing this uh, software check even though you have the latest version which I believe is that it doesn't matter it wants to check and it can't because the server 404 that doesn't exist and it used to be you could just hit retry it right there if you waited long enough because sometimes the Wi-Fi wouldn't catch up but now uh, and I've seen this online other people are getting this problem so this is a fair warning if, if you have a playbook you're gonna sell do not wipe it 
If you're going to give it away, don't wipe it. Just erase your stuff. You can't, but don't don't wipe it where somebody goes through a new process of loading up, because they will get stuck here. And this thing effectively is useless. It's utterly useless because of what they did. Uh, so if anyone knows any other way around this, or if somebody from RIM or BlackBerry sees this, please turn on the server. There's still thousands of these out there that people use for just mundane tasks. And I think it's ridiculous that you turned it off. Thanks.